Hey, good morning. Welcome back to my channel. Happy Monday. Ugh, not really. It's like the Mondayest Monday that's ever Mondayed. So, um, typically, you would be seeing a Tasty Tuesday today. Um, but there's other things happening. So today we needed to do laundry. So Jonathan brought down the laundry basket for me, which is awesome. After he left for work, I went ahead and started our first load and then he realized that he forgot his um, pills. He takes like some supplements and stuff in the morning. And so he asked for me to bring those up to him at work. So me and Milo went in the car, dropped off his pills. And whenever I got back, the washing machine had stopped. So I went to go move it from the washer to dryer, you know, like you do. And I opened up the washer. <gasps> And it's full of water, yay! So it was about right there on the cycle, so I was like, okay, what's happening? I, you know, tried, to, tried it again, didn't do anything. So I turned it to like right here, and it's just doing this, which isn't right. <laughs> so then I was like, okay, well, let me put it right here because the beginning of a cycle, it should drain all the water out. So I did that. And we got the same thing happening. That is not good and super annoying because we literally, you know, we're doing the debt snowball. I still haven't made our official video about that, but I was, I'm actually planning on um, filming that today. But we just paid off our Lowe's card and I'm just like, really? Really? <laughs> And I don't want to buy a new washing machine. So I did a little bit of research and talked to a couple of people and it sounds like it's probably a bad clutch, which technically I'm sure Jonathan and I could figure it out, but I mean, he works so much. I don't know when we'd have time, you know, to do it. So I'm gonna go to this little used appliance place, which is where we actually got that one from. We've had it for almost seven years. It lasted a really long time. And uh, they come with a three year warranty. So I think I'm just gonna go buy a used one and instead of, and just pay cash because I don't, I don't wanna buy a new one and have to open another line of credit or you know, add another bill to our bills because we're trying to get rid of the bills. All right, I'm back from Justified Appliances. I picked out the washer that we're gonna get. Um, it's gonna be a Maytag, same like an older used one, but um, it's a newer model than we currently have. It's gonna be delivered today between two and four, which is good news, so that way our clothes aren't gonna sit there wet forever, um, and I don't have to like go to the laundromat because, man, wet clothes are heavy. <laughs> All right, I got most of the water out. I need to get these clothes out and then I'll get the rest of the water out. But man, it's definitely not the cleanest process. Water. Ooh, look at the floors. They are all wet. The delivery guy from Justified just dropped off the new washer and hauled away the old one. Um, this is, see this is why I like these little smaller places because same day delivery is a win in my books. Um, especially because I have a whole bunch of wet clothes that need to get rewashed and dried. Um, and I really didn't want to have to lug them to a laundromat. But since I went ahead and had the laundry room pretty much emptied out, I cross-waved in there. And I was like, okay, if I'm cross-waving in there, I might as well go ahead and just cross-wave most of the downstairs. So basically I cross-waved everything that I could reach without having to like plug it in and move it around. Um, because there's really no point in me um like doing a really thorough job because it's raining again which means it's muddy and there's gonna be doggy tracks all over this floor um again by later tonight it's a little bit louder than the old one let's take a look at it it's got so many more options <laughs> the old one had like two things um and the capacity it's huge. It's huge, guys. So it's a super capacity, and um, it's really cool because that's actually 
So I have room to put more in there, um, but that was the low that I had started. So those were all the clothes that were wet. Um, and there was still room to put more in there. I'm making fried cabbage for dinner tonight. Yummy, yummy. And also just wanna say, those are not for us. Those are leftover from the last time that we had, like last weekend. Yeah, last weekend we had game night. I put some in the fridge for our guests. How I do my fried cabbage is I, I'm just gonna chop up the cabbage. Um, I'm gonna cook down this Italian sausage and I'm gonna mix it all together. Um, and then normally I put bacon in it, but I'm actually out of bacon, so I'm gonna use these real bacon pieces. And that's it. There it is. Doesn't it look tasty? I think so. It's one of our favorite things. I think I've been doing it since almost the beginning of keto. And normally I would wait for Jonathan, but I fasted today. So I'm eating, but he should be home pretty soon. Dinner has been eaten. Kitchen is cleaned up. Dinner's put away and everything. We're upstairs now playing on our computers. I'm going to catch up on some vlogs. I'm like super behind. I also need to catch up on my planner. I'm behind on that as well. This was last week, so I'm not super behind. I just need to like fill in the last couple of days. Speaking of dinner, before I forget, I did make that fried cabbage as a Tasty Tuesday before, so I'll leave a link up in the eye for that in case you want to try it out. It's really good. I mean, I wouldn't say that it's um, only for people who do keto. If you like cabbage and bacon, mm -hmm. it's, it's I mean, good. you can do it like just as a side and take out the Italian sausage, or you can do it as a meal like I do with the Italian sausage, like however you want to do it. I think my cousin Crystal does it with hamburger meat. All right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up the vlog. I know that you were expecting a Tasty Tuesday, um, but like I said, kind of had some things going on today and uh, had to take care of that, so I figured I would just do kind of like a day in the life. But subscribe if you haven't already. Don't forget to click that thumbs up button, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. We are on our way out to go have dinner with friends. 